we know that we need to provide our students a world-class education in Olathe. We need to provide them every experience that we can to help them be successful when they leave. One of the things that we know has happened across our country in many places is language immersion programs. The research to support language immersion and the kind of learning kids do and the ability to not only learn another language but to think and speak in another language really sets them up for success when they leave our system. So although half of their day is the is completely instructed in, in Spanish in a different language that does not minimize their academics. When they go in their materials, um, they have different materials, but they are keeping up with all state standards, all district curriculum. So there's no, there are no gaps there. They're just in addition to that, learning it in a different language and they're able to do it in a conversational way and an academic way. Cuatro. Cuatro. Es igual. Oh, they surprise me every day. I remember at the beginning of the school year, and anybody that has walked into my classroom can tell you, at the beginning of the school year, it was very, very one step at a time, so many visuals, so much repetition, and you kind of wondered, are they ever going to understand this? And then it, they just picked it up like that. After a month or so, they were able to understand if I said la fila, they knew that meant go to the line. Or if I say sentadito con las piernas cruzadas, they knew that meant sit crisscross applesauce. And then coming back from winter break, you would think, oh, they haven't used the language for two weeks, they're going to forget everything. That was not the case. They were able to retain the information over winter break, even though they weren't practicing at home, and they were able to show that in the classroom. So I am just, every day I am surprised by what they know, and and how they can interact with the language. In the morning, I greet one of our groups. We've got blue group and green group. We don't really call them Senora Thorso's class or Mrs. Rex's class because we are both of their teachers. So I will greet one of those classes in the morning and we spend our morning doing reading and writing activities, um, everything in English. Then when they go to lunch and specials, music and PE, after that we switch classrooms where they actually get their backpack and their coats and we'll switch to a different room. And then I take that other opposite group um, and I have them in the afternoon and do the same exact activities. Um, and Senor Thorsel takes the other group and does it all in Spanish, so. Just the way that they are able to switch back and forth between English and Spanish has been pretty amazing to me. It doesn't seem like it requires a lot of effort. They're just able to do it naturally, and so that's been really cool. I mean, you're talking about seven and eight-year-olds who switch classes halfway through the day. Um, the organizational skills that they have to develop to bring materials back and forth between classes is amazing. I think for the most part, most of my students are not only engaged, but they're learning. They're learning the language, they're using it in other places, in the building, they're going home and sharing with their parents. They shared how much the kids were singing at home and how much they were trying to teach others at home, other family members. So that's really exciting to, to hear feedback and when I see the growth in my own classroom and I see all the students engaged, participating and sharing and eager to share what they know or what they've learned, it just, it just makes my job the best. Not everybody has this opportunity, but we know that these kids are going to leave this program from fifth grade and follow up like bilingual. I mean, just from seeing the growth that they have shown from the beginning of the year to where they're right now, it is definitely something to celebrate. My dream, and I don't think this is different than, than probably anyone who wants what's best for our students, um, I want our students to be able to be competent and competitive in a global world. And that's one of the things that by students graduating from our system and being bilingual or trilingual even, and having the ability to communicate in more than one language just sets them up for tremendous life success, no matter what career path they choose. Um, and so I think it's going to give our students an opportunity to, to be ahead.